Hey everyone, Henry from Smoky Hills Outdoor Store here in Park Rapids and I want to quickly run through a couple of products that have been favorites of our customers and uh, I'm just going to walk around a little bit and grab some stuff. The first one I want to go to is the Firehouse Tap Ups. Um, the inventor of these, uh, we actually have a video of him posted online and he does an absolutely awesome job with these. So there's really two very popular models that we have right here. The first one is called the Artec Claw and as you can see it's got a, this really sturdy plastic housing, it folds up really tight. You can get quite a few of these into a bucket and then uh, pretty nice hardware on it as well. A lot of stainless steel, a lot of brass on here, an actual silicone flag which you don't see a whole lot. So I'm just going to open this up, I can put my flag in right here, extend it up and uh, well we all know how this guy works. There you go, there's a tip up. Now one of the things I really like about this tip up Nate is if I pull this out of the water I can actually angle my tip up and put it down like this and as you can see my spool is not in the slush. I can just put this right over the hole and start pulling out here because nothing worse than getting the spool right into the ice. So I'm going to move on to one that's kind of turned quite a few heads and this is kind of the lit advanced firehouse tip up and I'm going to grab it real quick and uh, see if we hopefully don't set it off. I'm going to show you what makes this really unique. Obviously we have the setup already and I'm going to just turn this like a fish is going to get it and there you go. This is actually lit up tip up and these are actually very familiar. Anybody that's a first responder or maybe an ambulance services will recognize these. These are the new flare pucks. So these are really heavy duty. This is what a lot of emergency services use to put out on the road. And it doesn't just have the one mode, there's quite a few different modes. You have a nice strobe, uh, you have a little bit slower strobe, kind of a running lights there, a blinking, solid on, a dim, and then one that I kind of like, it's directional. So you wouldn't necessarily see this from that side, but you would from this side. And then also a flashlight. So, pretty cool product right here. Folds up nice and tight, uh, which is really nice with this product. There we go, gotta go the other way. So it folds up really nice and tight and it's pretty weatherproof, really nice canvas material on this. So uh, check out Firehouse Step Ups. I'm pretty impressed with this company. We do sell all of these on GoIceFish.com. Next product, you know, we're pretty much uh, in the Ice Castle Fish House, the big wheeled fish houses. So we really do prefer to go propane or electric. A lot of good augers out there. I do want to show this one, it's one of our new favorites. It's from Eskimo, and as you can see, it's a 10 inch auger, which uh, I kind of like to drill 10 inch holes. You know, everybody's got their favorite. Uh, I just like the 10 inch hole, good blade on it. Propane, really simple. Open up the propane. There you go. But you can't get any easier than that. I would not start up a gas auger in the, in the store. And then right there, close the valve. Good to go for the next time. So pretty fun product, also available on guysfish.com. Once we get a little bit of ice, we'll go drill some holes and see how all of these perform. We have used them in the past, but uh, they say they've kind of upgraded these a little bit this year, this year. So we're going to put them to the test. Uh, Nate, if you want to peek up top there, a lot of hole sleeves, uh, always a good product. Uh, we stock all of the catch cover brand products and all of the fish hole buddy products. So uh, all of this you can see is online. And let's go over to another wall, yeah? Uh, which has a couple more of our favorites on it. So we're going to start with a cat's cover. Really good product. Uh, keeps your cell phone and keys and even the kids and the dog out of the hole so nobody gets a wet foot. Uh, we have all the different styles available. We have a lot of them in stock uh, for both the fish hole buddy which is the T-handle you'll see on ice castles and also for the catch covered brand with or without the sleeves. I've got a video explaining those a little bit. Uh, on uh, either our YouTube page or on uh, our Facebook page for Smoke Heels Outdoor Store. Some glow rattle reels from Fish Hole Buddy. Uh, they've been around a long time. They got a good, good uh, nice rattle to them. The uh, Catch Cover Rattlesnake, excellent product. Uh, this has been one of our best selling products. One that I kind of look forward to this year is a cell phone, a smartphone holder that they have, uh, which has got a really good grip on it and a really nice tension adjustment screw so it'll hold your phone if you want to kind of do some 
uh, footage uh, of you catching a fish. Also have an electronics mount for like a GoPro. They have the clamp on ones and they also have the discs. So you don't have to buy a ton of rattlesnakes. You can just kind of move all the accessories around. Ultimate Outdoors, couple of new colors uh, that just came in. The pink camo and then also the new orange camo. Um, guys from Ultimate Outdoors just launched these. And you can also now get separate brackets for these if you want to buy more than one bracket that are available online. You know, Nate, we can keep going on and on. LED lights, I mean, uh, definitely something. If you don't have LED lights in your house yet, uh, this is the one that you would put in the whole lights. They just pull out, push in. They would also fit in most of the fixtures, or you can just upgrade to a fixture as well. Well, that's my story. I thought I'd show a couple of different products. You know, as you can tell uh, by my voice, I'm pretty excited uh, for ice fishing. We've had some customers and uh, some of my employees actually go out and do a little bit of tip out fishing. Please be careful out there. The ice is not safe yet, but we will keep you informed. This Sunday, we will have a full report on all the ice conditions. We will post it on Facebook. We'll get some uh, good advice from our friends on Red Lake, we'll get some uh, input from Leech Lake and we'll get some input on all the local lakes around us like Long and Fishhook and really go and see what the ice looks like and uh, hopefully we can get out there and do a little bit of fishing. As always, stay safe, thank you for watching our videos and uh, we hope to see you out on the ice pretty soon.